What's going on, y'all? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on, y'all? It's Friday. What's going on? What y'all got going on today? Yes, indeed. What's going on, y'all? What's going on? What's going on? I'm so glad y'all tuning in. We got so much to talk about this morning. Y'all know it's Friday. It's club day. It's the last day of work. If you work a nine to five, if you do anything positive, I ain't even gonna say that, y'all. Look, we got so much to talk about. Like, what are y'all doing this weekend? What's going on? Comment down below. Let me know what y'all got going on. YouTube channel, subscribe, like. Ah. <laughs> I'm so glad y'all tuning in this morning. We have so much to talk about, as I said before. Like, I'm trying to figure out what y'all gonna do today because I'm gonna go walking probably. You know, got a little shopping to go do. You know, you know how we do on Fridays, you know. I think I'm going to go out and go run a couple errands for the house. And then I'm going to go to the park, you know, because it's Easter weekend. I forgot to say that, too. Yes, Easter. Yes, yes, yes. I like Easter, a little bunny hop. <laughs> child, let me stop playing with child this morning. But anyways, um, on a serious note, I'm um, going to go out and do some grown-up things, you know. I'm not going to be so goofy. Because <laughs> I'm a goofy-ass klutz sometimes, too, you know. I call a little young person named Dave a klutz. Let me stop playing. Hold up, y'all. Hold up. I feel like I'm at the club already. Hold on. Let's have a drink out after that. We can leave. I need a drink. Throw that bag on my bad little bitch nigga. Got every ex nigga mad and they big bitter. Diamonds on the chain. Y'all feel right? I need to cover like a bitch nigga. Working me pussy good so we been hooked. If you got seen out with me, it's a big look. Working hot body smoking like a big blunt. Oh, bro, nigga. Make it out of big cats today. She said you're stunned like a big shot. A lot of motherfuckers be stunned definitely on the weekend. Oh, I'm talking to Georgie. Let me get back right, y'all. <laughs> but no, like a lot of people be stunned on the weekend. Y'all know y'all don't be having no damn money. Then y'all go to the club with 20 fucking dollars. Want somebody to buy you a drink. I hope y'all ain't doing that in 2021 still, girl. You know, y'all ain't going to tell me because y'all know I'm going to spill that tea. Y'all ain't going to tell me, bitch, that Sarah's still spending 20 in the club. Girl, you 30 years old. Why are you still playing up in them if you ain't sitting there doing something constructive in that bitch? You ain't owning it yet. I'm just advertising my little glass. So cute, ain't it? Uh, <laughs> mm. Yeah. But anyways, like I said, once and for all, I don't even know what the fuck I'm saying this morning, child. I'm just on here being goofy. I ain't gonna lie. Like, last night was everything. My show was everything. I don't feel like this morning I had to really sit here and uh, and play, you know? Like, and sit here and stun, bitch. I had watched the thing, like, eight to ten times. <laughs> I ain't woke up out my switch and watch it again. Because I, I was like, this was really me? Like, really? We are so fucking goofy and creative. Like, that was very talented. I have to give you those, you know, accolades on those. I kudos to the crew. Y'all come through for me yesterday. Like y'all really, really did. And the energy though that I mean, that 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 goes without saying. That's when people really support you and fuck with you hard. In real life, like that's the only people I want around me though. I don't want nobody else that's gonna be sitting there trying to, you know, demise me as a person or make me feel low. You know, I'm not gonna do that at all. I'm I'm gonna <laughs> rise above you know when they hit low i hit high i just get the hell away from you i don't even want to hit low too much no more it's like doing this is really opening me up and i'm able to experience new things and i feel more at peace you know i don't deal with anybody anyways like that but it's like actually coming out this is my way of going to the club this is my way of being interactive with other people because I'm, you know, a hermit at the end of the day. So they get to see this live side of me and don't even have to touch me. <laughs> I love it. I love it. So I, I get to go around to everybody now. 
Finally. Now, everybody get to see what the fuck they've been trying to find out for um, 10, 15 years. Uh, you know, the girls. You know, y'all get to see who I am as a person. Y'all get to see. Finally. You don't have to worry about my exes, my girlfriends, boyfriends, you know, cousins, families, whoever telling you get to see it for me. Bitch, I'm a clown. That's why they loved it. They loved every second. They ate it up. They socked it up. They got mad because they couldn't have it no more. And that's how people get. It's okay. You know, I don't get upset with them. I love them. I love everybody that's ever been in my life. And I always love them. I'm always going to wish them well. We might have got into it, act a fool with each other. That's what people do. But they get over it if they have any sense. You know, it's just some people you can't come back from, though. So don't think you can just come back to all them people because all of them can't be come back to. I got a few of them that I just, I, I, I. Had to, you know, put them in somewhere, you know, away from me <laughs> and a lot of others. But um, that was so goofy of me, you know. But no, for real, though, sometimes you just got to dispose of people and just keep them away from you. Like, just keep them just out of your aura, your circle. And I'm learning as I get older. And definitely, like I said, this show is really opening me up even more to really develop. In all the ways that I never thought I could. Because like I said, I used to be out there really, really bad at one point. Um, I'm not going to say bad like I was on dope or some shit. You know, I was just a person that was well-rounded. And a lot of people couldn't respect that because they couldn't be that that king. Or, you know, they couldn't be that person that could pretty much just be himself and still get attention. Like, it was no extras to it. I was being myself, always. I've always been myself. And a lot of people couldn't take that. So, with that being said, oh, well, kudos to you. I, I give the hand claps to all the people that tried to stop me or make me feel low or to try to demise my character. I, I give y'all that. Because y'all still never stop me. Look at me. I'm 30 years old. I look damn good, baby. Look, 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 look. I, 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 I have y'all. Young me, I might need to get these little braces on the bottom of these teeth. I'm going to get them when I feel like it's going to get them real line. I just give me some Invisalign. I just really feel like that's natural, so I never wanted to fuck with my natural shit. Unlike most of y'all, y'all all, all want to change shit. It's only one thing that I told everybody I will fix up a little bit. I'm going to handle that later on down the line. But I don't need to. It's, you know, when you finally love your life, it's like, bitch, you don't need nothing but air. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. That's sometimes that's all when I'm with them. That's all I be feeling like I need is air. I don't care about nothing else. Like when you find somebody that makes you feel like from the belly all the way up every day with butterflies, y'all get into it, and ten minutes later you just gotta be kissing and hugging and saying, "Baby, why you don't want to treat me like <laughs> you know?" And look, that's when you know you found that person. You know, I, I don't know about y'all, but that's y'all when I found me. <laughs> I don't mean me. <laughs> yes, indeed, girl. But did y'all enjoy y'all April Fool's yesterday? I did. A, we did a big prank on one of my friends yesterday. Hey, y'all! It, it's April first. <laughs> Just a stupid like this dude be coming to the top of his head, y'all. Like he comes from the top of his head, like for real, dog. <laughs> it be so funny. It really be funny, like in real. <laughs> What is it, retrospect? <laughs> uh, that's what it is. Putting it in, you know, I, I know a little bit of terminology, you know. I'm not that dumb. I try to act like it sometimes because I don't want people to be all in my Kool-Aid. I be like, girl, I'm dumb. <laughs> yeah, I know what they be thinking. I'm very smart. Very, very. I would never let nobody demise that. And anybody has been around me, no fucking will. I'm a G with it. Sexy lips, ain't it? <laughs> I get to give them a kiss because that's all they be want. Y'all be want some love from me. Tell the truth. All y'all bitches that's always backbitten and talk shit about me. Y'all just wanted to kiss and some love. I could have gave y'all that. Mm, let me give it to you on camera. I'm loving all y'all. All in my little bosom. All in it. Like, come on. Like, y'all need to grow up. Like, y'all be talking about me. I do this shit for the kicks. Anybody that really know me know I live my motherfucking life to the fullest extent of the law. You know what I'm saying? I don't sit back here playing and be scared. I, I shit jumping off boats, jumping into rivers. I don't want to get no planes right now, but um, I I fly, but I'm not trying to jump out one, you know. Going all kinds, I do it all. I love it. I like going go-kart racing, four-wheeler riding, bitch, horseback riding, and I do it. 
Yes, I do, bitch. I have my fun. I'm going going. I ain't gonna tell y'all, but I'll be doing something pretty soon. You know, I might go ahead and film that too. Also, I want y'all to know that my morning shows will start running properly once I can find me a decent um, you know, situation ship. <laughs> because I don't be knowing like sometimes this stuff just do what it do, and I do what I do, and I talk my little shit. Camera, 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 and camera. That made a lot of sense, didn't it? Y'all, I'm just joking out this morning. It's Friday. I really, I'm not going to hold y'all up, even if y'all come in out. Like, I feel like this is the day that you go to work with a big ass smile on your face because this is the last day of the week. Like, for me, it's the last day of the fucking week. Yes. And I can sit back and let my hair down, which is already down. I look good, though. I be doing it myself. Now I'm learning. My man taught me how to do it. I be here. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, I'd be all okay. Oh, oh, that's stupid, huh? But I be doing all that. You know, they say sexy. Boy, if I take my shirt off, them niggas might go ahead and, and fall the fuck out. It got a little something under there, too, y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I'm so ignorant. I'm weak. I'm weak, child. I'm weak. I'm weak. I'm weak. That's what Georgia be saying. I'm weak, baby. Can you help me get off? Get me off this bed, please. Please. Please help me up. Y'all. I just hope y'all have fun today at work. I hope y'all really, really enjoy y'all day. I hope y'all do something really fun tonight. Y'all need to let go. Definitely the single mothers. Y'all know I always speak on single mothers. Please enjoy yourself. Find you a nanny or a babysitter for the night. And let the let your hair down, put your beautiful dress on, and go out. Enjoy so stay safe though, because it's still COVID out there. Wear your face shield. Don't put the mask on. Like, let me tell you something, you're gonna be okay. That everybody needs to stop worrying so much. Make sure you stay safe with your practice safe, you know, distance is still, but go out and have your good time. Live. Everybody that's inside right now, stay your ass inside because you need to be there. Everybody that do what you do. Do what you do. I don't judge. I just have y'all fun. I don't do all that going out unless I'm going to an event or something. I I just I I don't believe in running into the the street like that when I can I make my home the club. You know I got my own club in this bitch. Cut the music up. Put the drink on. Cut the lights down. You know and do because I feel like being around too many people it, it puts too much into your spirit. All the stuff they going through, even though you're not associating yourself with them at that moment or in that time, anything I feel like they got attached to them and you in the same area, it's steady rubbing off and inflicting into your life. That's why I just stay away from you because people be so toxic in the mind. They thinking evil thoughts and it's jumping out. That's how I feel. People got so much evil around them. And it's just, I stay. I'd rather stay my goofy looking ass right here and mind my motherfucking business. Exactly that point in case. Like all that. Everybody want to be so social and, and, and so, oh, I got to be in this. I got to be in this limelight for the moment. Or I have to do this. I have to do that. Mm -mm. When you learn to be grown and pay your bill, save your little money, pay your tithes at church and and do the right shit. You ain't going to worry about the rest because the guy going to keep it flowing in. He going to keep it coming abundantly. No matter, sometimes it might seem tight, it might get hard, but that's when God is working the hardest for you. He letting you know you better not give up, my child, because I'm right here. Somebody need to hear this message. I don't know who it's coming from, but look, I'm telling you, y'all better hold on. The breakthrough is almost here. I'm telling you, I'm telling you what I know. Once things start getting tough, I don't care about none of this little junk you got going on, all that crap. When it's at its roughest state, God is working hard in your favor. He's working on your behalf right now because I know he's doing it for me. I get up with a smile every morning, every single day, even when it's hard. You know, because God tells you he got you if you believe. You have not because you ask not. That's in his word. Go let him know. Don't go to my guy for no money, though. That's stupid. Just ask him for the help and strength like I do. You don't go to him for all that. I don't feel like you need to go for that when he gave you free will and gave you help and strength to get your ASS up to go to work. Hello, that's where your money coming from. <clears throat> get your ass up and go to work. Hmm. 
Sure did say it just like that. And point in case, what you say, girl? Huh? Get your ass to work. Like, that's the only way you're going to get it. Like, I'm for real. God going to do the rest. You know, he's going to do the rest for you. All you got to do is and show him. Get put effort. Put forth effort. Faith without works is what, y'all? Dead. That's what they say. I'm just telling y'all. Uh, I jumped over here a little bit. It just it came out of my spirit. I don't know where it come from, but I'm telling y'all. Enjoy yourself, you know, and, and let God lead y'all. Make sure y'all, when y'all do stuff, you know, tonight or this weekend for Easter, please practice um pra practice safe distancing and, and, and just and, and be safe all around the board because there's gonna be a lot of people out there. It's gonna be a lot of people moving around this weekend trying to get to the beach, trying to get um, to the stores and get alcohol. So please be careful. If y'all don't take nothing from my show, please be careful this weekend because it's going to be a busy, busy weekend. They don't start lifting certain restrictions. So it's a lot of different stuff open now. And I just want y'all to be safe. Love your family. Stay close to your family this weekend. You ain't got to go. If you drinking, go ahead and let one of them family members go ahead to the store for you. Uncle James, don't let nobody go to the store. For, don't let nobody, you know, drive, you know. Y'all know I ain't talking about going and just make sure everybody's straight out there. You know, I, I want y'all all to be safe. Don't let them people be driving and drinking and stuff, y'all. That's that's not right. You see somebody, y'all having a good time this weekend. Make sure y'all got enough of everything before you go. That's what a lot of people don't do. They want to get a little bit here. If, it's just like putting gas in your car. You're going to put $10 in or you're going to just go ahead and fill it up so you ain't got to worry about it for the week. Every time you got to think about it, you put five in here, here. Then you got to put six in here, here. And then you got to go over here and put 10 more here. That's not fucking living. That, that, that's, that's, that's pathetic. It's 2021. Fill it all the way up. Meaning when you go to the store, get everything you need right then. You know, get everything you need. And, and you won't have that problem. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people don't want to do the right things, and they feel when 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 the consequences come from their action, oh, it, it's not my fault. I didn't do nothing wrong. Yes, you did. I mean, yes, you did. You went out there drinking and driving. So it's practice safe, you know, practices. And I'm about to get off the